and welcome to high school. We're here to welcome you, but also to talk to you about something serious. We're going to tell you the story of our friend Katie, how she moved here from Kenya, and how her dodgy decisions caused another girl to get hit by a bus. Actions and consequences. Um, this painting I made will represent teenage female power. And this picture of George Michael is something I like to hold when I'm singing. But how far would you go to be popular and hot? Would you resist temptation? No, you would not. Just admit it. Sounds like green is what you are. Green is easier than nice. And no green can take you far. Maybe this will make you think twice. Hit, lay out, bossy. This is a cautionary tale. My life in Kenya ends. Don't be sad. We knew this was coming. Life often has goodbyes. You killers. But I'm gonna miss you guys. Somewhere out there is a different kind of pride. Preferably one that won't eat me if I die. Human kids who might even walk upright. Who will talk about boys and dreams and life and not kill everything inside. Did you ever get a feeling everybody else is happy? Everybody else has friends, and they're better friends than yours. It's a very recent feeling, but it's running through my body and it roars. It roars. Katie, honey, have a pill take bar. It's a long ride to Jomo Kenyatta. I'm sorry I had to take this new job, Katie.
right, can I have your attention, please? Hello? May I have your attention, please? We have a new student joining us today. She just moved here from Arkansas. Um, Africa. Right, Africa. Everyone welcome Caddy. It's Katie. Katie, all right. See, I don't do well with these modern names. Back in my day, we were named either Lisa or Keith. That was it. Now I have a nephew named Drogon. <laughs> Why don't you introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Katie Heron. No. Oh my oh. God! Oh. No! No! Hi, I'm Miss Norberry. I'll be your homeroom teacher. I see I also have you in AP Calculus. You must have had excellent teachers at your old school. Oh, um, I was homeschooled. <laughs> oh, homeschooled. That's a fun way to steal money from my union. Uh, right, um, no, my parents are biologists, so we've been living in Kenya. But yeah, I love calculus. That's the nicest thing anyone's ever said to me. <laughs> and I've been married twice. Okay. Anyways, you think you can follow the schedule? I think so. Well, it can be hard for a homeschooled student. You'll have to be moving from class to class. <laughs> this is first period American literature. My name is Mr. Buck. Hey, um, you don't want to sit there. Don Schweitzer saves that seat for her boyfriend. Can I just sit here today? Not unless you want to tickle my back, skank. Matthew, no, no, Schweitzer, no, 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 it's for one set. Okay, come on, to the cup. Je m'appelle Katie. Incorrect. Hey, hey, make your French name. The French people I know just call me Katie. Did you say Marie? Marie. Marie. Janice. Janice. Chanel. No! Fontaine. No! Lady Gaga! No! <laughs> Welcome to Health and Human Sexuality. This fall we're going to be doing the state acquired unit and abstinence. In the spring we do self-esteem and choking. <laughs> Where do you think you're going, hotshot? I need to urinate. No way, Jose. It's Katie. You gotta ask permission, and then you gotta carry the lavatory pass that is a carving of a whale. May I please have the lavatory pass? Nice try. You can go at lunch. I'm 16, just like everyone here, but I'm not like everyone here. It's clear, it's gonna be a rough year. New kid sucks! We have codes, social signifiers that they all seem to get, but not me. Not yet. Did you ever get a feeling? Expectations need adjusting And you need to lick your wounds In the ladies' bathroom Oh, you what? Weirdo! I'm not quitting, I'm regrouping So I'll sit and eat my sandwich And tomorrow I'll find friends who hear the call The same call, the need to be long that roars within us all. from using drugs. No, I was... Hi, I'm Janice. And je m'appelle Sasha Fierce. <laughs> this is Damien. He's almost too gay to function. <laughs> I'm Katie. Well, Katie, as junior co-chair of the Student Activities Committee and his art freak, we volunteer to be your starter companions till you find your place at North Shore. What he's saying is we'll help you, Caddy. <laughs> Thank you so much, but it's Katie. Yeah, I'm gonna call you Caddy. When did you move here? Three days ago. Why'd you stop being homeschooled? I wanted to get socialized. Oh, you'll get socialized, all right. A little slice like you. <laughs> what are you doing? You're not supposed to be in here. Danny DeVito, I love your work! <laughs> <laughs> okay, Caddy. I once read on a tote bag that everything fits somewhere. So let's get out there and pick your new life. 
My mama used to tell me, baby girl, don't ever eat lunch on the john. Your mother called you baby girl? Singing. <laughs> so what if all the ducklings think you're ugly? It's because they've never seen a swan. It takes all kinds of people who need people, so find people you can bear. We'll find your group, your hurry, your flock. Come take a walk and to answer my small questionnaire, which I'll sing to you. the cafeteria, shall we? I'll show you the world as I see it. Varsity jocks and JV jocks will throw you in a locker if you say hello. The rich stoners hate the gangster whites, so though they're all smoking the same oregano. Here's the sexually active bad geeks. I've got two words for you, I'm sure and you. And if you like, Marching with tromboners. This is the group for you! Back me up, show choir! But they might be crazy and dancy. They like to compete, but neither team would take me, so they can fight me. Who's that? Darling, that's the math lead. Oh. Joining them is social suicide. It's a college application to the They wear their awkwardness with stubborn pride, and this is my dance break. Why it's Janice? 
their shiny fake and hard. They play their little mind games all around the schoolyard. They might insult your clothing or make fun of your name. Like they mocked Jen Moorcock till she burst into flame. And Miss Moorcock was a teacher. Regina George is the queen bee. She's always dressed up. She's been spring clean queen. We're just strong sewer for her then.